Hey guys, and welcome to another FIFA 22 Foot Heroes player review. And uh, in this video, guys, we'll be taking a look at the 85 rated Lars Ricken. Uh, just like you can cover also part of that 96 slash 97 uh, Borussia Dortmund Champions League winning side where they beat Juventus uh, in the final. And um, listen, he was okay. He cost me 160,000 coins, which is pretty much the average price that he's going for on the market right now. Uh, a few people might want to play him as a centre mid or play him as a centre four, but I think most of you guys will probably play him in the position that he comes at and packs as in that cam roll. And he was okay. I mean, he got me two goals and two assists in the five games, which isn't the worst return in the world. But I would argue that, for example, someone like a Bruno Fernandes, who, um, you know, is like 88 rated and is a similar price, in fact, maybe slightly cheaper when it last checked compared to Rickon will probably play at least just as well, maybe even slightly better. And I did a review on, on Bruno Fernandes as well the uh, the other week. But uh, I still thought his passing was good. He's got 84 in both vision and short passing. He got a, a very nice assist from a corner. Uh, you know, his, his general passing in, in, in open play was pretty good. You know, his through balls in particular, that's why his vision was obviously very good. Uh, I thought his dribbling was actually pretty good as well. 87 reactions, 83 ball control, uh, in-game dribbling and composure also pretty nice. Agility and balance isn't the worst for this stage of the game. Uh, he, he did score me two goals, but he also missed quite a few chances for me as well in general, where I thought he could have done a lot better for me. And in general, they weren't really from the Five games there weren't too much highlights that he got you know for a lot of the games you know he, he wasn't terrible and whenever he, whenever he picked up the ball a lot of things that he would tend to do would go on to lead him to create chances but he would just go missing in in, in some of the games that I was playing him with and so when I came to finish the five games with him I actually saw that I didn't have that many highlights with him but um, he, he didn't do too much wrong I just don't think he's He's not terrible value for money compared to some of the other foot hero cards, but he's not like insane value for money at the same time, you know. Uh, not too hard to link him being German from the Bundesliga, but I just think there's better alternatives. Like a Bruno Fernandes would play better than him in my in my personal opinion. He's okay. He's not the best. He's not the worst at the same time. Uh, I think a 7 out of 10 is good rating for him. But anyway, guys, that'll finish off this video. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you guys later.